it's Kamari and today I'm coming to you guys with another coach haul so um, some of these items I did get during the Black Friday sale and some of them I did not so I'm gonna go through and show them to you guys today um, I have three prints that I'm going to be showing you guys so some of the items are signature print things some are the ornament print and then another set of the items are just the regular um, leather but they're the same colors so without further ado, I'm not going to talk your head off. Let's get started. The first thing that I wanted to talk about is something that I've wanted for quite some time now, but I just couldn't get myself to buy it for whatever reason. Um, No particular reason why. I'm just like, do I really need it? But honestly, I do need it. So I'm going to show it to you guys. So this is the Coach pencil case. I've been wanting this for a while just to put my pencils in, but I was hesitant about it because um, I wasn't sure how it would look in person because... You know, when Coach takes pictures of items on their website, the light kind of oversaturates it and makes it look like kind of orangey. So I didn't know if this would look appealing to me. I didn't want it to be on the orangey side, but I'm so glad that I got it because it's not orangey. But this is my pencil case. I've seen some people use it for makeup. I don't intend to use it for that purpose. I intend on using it for my highlighters and my pens because I do like to write in my planners and I want to get back into journaling. So this is the inside of the pencil case. I believe it's lined with leather. I'm not sure, but it's such an attractive pencil case. And I tried to take the cheap route and buy a pencil case off of Amazon. And I'm just like, yeah, this ain't it. I'm gonna go get the one from Coach. And I'm so glad that I did because I got it on sale when it was additional, I think either 15 or 20% off. And I think I got it for like $21. And I think it's currently about $28. So yeah. So the next item that I got actually came in a set. And and this is the coin pouch from Coach in the evergreen pattern. One thing about me is I love me some evergreen, the evergreen print, I should say, because I do have the mini camera bag, um, the tech wallet, and I do have the mini skinny ID case in the evergreen pattern. And so when I saw this, I was hesitant on getting this as well because it came with a earbud holder, but I don't have any set of earbuds that could hold it. I think it's for the AirPod first and second generation. I do have like a AirPods Pro dupe that I got off of DH Gate, but it won't fit that. So I just decided to give it away, even though it was so cute. If I did have some AirPods, I would have kept it, but it had to go. It didn't make sense to hoard it and be a hoarder if I wasn't going to really use it for anything of importance. So I gave it away. And I love how structured it is. So I thought, oh, I wasn't sure what to expect. But it's definitely not a flimsy um, material. It's very sturdy. Um, it's not going to bend too much on you. This is the inside of it. It has the patch in the back. The authenticity patch. And then it's like a, like a deep purple interior. And I love this case so much. So on to the next item. So the next item um, I had in my previous video that I just uploaded it two weeks ago for the Coach Lane bag. And it is this beautiful Coach wristlet. I love this wristlet so much. I love the two-tone print. I love the signature canvas. And then I love this white leather in the middle. I just think that's such a pretty combination. And then I also love the white strap as well. I just think that's so pretty. And I really like Coach's wristlets just because I like to put things in them and I have been slowly growing my collection of them and I really, really like them. Um, I'm going to show you guys the inside of it. And the inside is just this really, ooh, let me move this paper. <laughs> the inside of it is just this really pretty brown color. 
and it comes with two um, card slots. And if you wanted to know the price tag of it, although this is not what I paid for it. But yes, and this is the wristlet. I love this wristlet so much. So the next thing that I got from Coach is another thing that I've been wanting for a while as well. But I just wasn't sure about it and I don't know why. It's just like, do I really need another one? But yes, yes I do. And this is the Coach Notebook. Now I wasn't sure if I wanted to get this because I do have quite a few notebooks that I have not filled up yet. And I don't like to be wasteful and just have paper lying around. So, but I did want to get this because I'm not, I, I don't intend on throwing it away and I will find a purpose for it. But I just thought it was so beautiful. I love the outside of it, like the casing for it. And I, I love that it also comes with a notebook. Um, I do still have the tag on it because I haven't used it yet, but this is the price. But I think I got this for about $25, $23, I can't remember. But um, I will put it on the screen. And I love this notebook so much because it's so cute. Um, if you open it up, the interior is brown. And then on the button, it does say coach on it. You know how coach do, they gotta let you know that this is a coach product. And then it does have this beautiful white coach um, logo on this clear piece of paper. And it looks so beautiful against the white paper. And then if you open this side, this is removable. Mine is a little wrinkly because I was kind of shoved it back in there because I'm a perfectionist and when I would close it, the white paper would extend out. So I had to push it back in there because I did not like that. So yes, and it does come with this saying or um, some writing on the back and yeah. So I really love this purchase. I do not regret it. I'm still trying to figure out what I shall use it for, but to be determined, but I'm so happy that I bought this. So. Then the last signature print item is something that I've really been wanting for a very long time and somebody influenced me to buy it so I bought it and when I first got it I was like hmm this is not what I thought it would be like it wasn't that it was not I didn't like it well I think what the problem was is that I was looking at it I got the I received the bag at nighttime and you know my lights are not very bright in my house so it's like in low lighting it didn't look that appealing to me but once I saw it in like daylight and like a brighter light I fell in love with it and I can't wait to rock this bag so so this is the coach Georgie shoulder bag and blocked signature canvas and it's so beautiful look at that i believe it's blocked signature canvas and khaki but look at this bag it's so pretty and i saw another youtuber um with this bag i'm gonna link her channel down below so this is the front of the bag so beautiful you guys so beautiful and one thing about me i love me some neutrals and i love me some black and i love me some snake skin and this bag has everything that i love in it in one so it has a snake pattern on the side and the bottom, which is very beautiful. And then it has the back and it does have an exterior pocket here. And it does come with two straps, which is pretty cool. Now this one I did not get during the sale. Um, I got it when it was um, it was not in stock during the sale. So I think I got it for $225, which is not a great price because it's um, I believe it's like $180 right now. So there's that. But shout out to Kalarna because I use that. <laughs> but this is the inside of the bag. So it comes with a zipper pocket right here. Um, one compartment right here and a pocket in the front here. And this bag is so cute. And I'm going to show you guys the straps. And I will be doing um, mod shots at the end for this bag. Okay, so this is with the shoulder strap on it. It's super cute. And then I'll show you guys how it looks with the crossbody straps. I am so in love with this bag. I do not regret it. I love the little Georgie emblem or, you know, this thing. It is a magnetic closure. And it's super cute. It is so gorgeous, you guys. And it does come with the black um, bag charm tag whatever you want to call it and then this is the tag oh wait do i not have the price on there oh yes i do so yes this bag is so gorgeous and i'm hoping that i can rock this right and do it justice because man this is a bad bad bag okay it's just as bad and, and and funny enough when i had before i got my coach lane bag i actually wanted this first but it was um sold out but i'm glad that i have both of them because man 
Y'all see this bag, it's super cute, so. Okay, so now we're going to move on to the ornament print collection. Um, I got three things from that. I believe there were more items um, with included in it, if I'm not mistaken, I could be wrong, but let's get started. So, I got this mini boxy case. So I already own a mini boxy case that I purchased off of Poshmark and I paid $40 for it, but I wanted another one just to have a little bit of a variety and not be, you know, <laughs> stuck to one pattern. Cause one thing about me, I want things, if I like something, I'm gonna get it in another color or another print. And I'm just gonna have multiples of that. And yeah, that's terrible, right? Anyways. So this is the boxy um, mini cosmetic case and I'm going to open her up so you can see the inside of her. And I kind of try to um, keep the papers and some of these things just so they can stay remain structured. So this is the <laughs> So this is the inside of it. It's this beautiful light um, tan color. And then it does have like a pocket in the back. Maybe if you wanted to use it for a card or something, I'm not sure. You can use it for that. This is the side of it. It's so beautiful. I love the ivory print with the different color ornaments. It's so cute. This thing is so cute and it does hold quite a bit. Or at least like the, the important things. If you're a person that doesn't wear at a uh, a lot of makeup on the daily if you wear a minimum amount daily then this is perfect for you and that's totally me even though I got a full face today I did it for this video but normally I'm just you know filling my eyebrows put on some lip gloss and maybe some mascara and go cuz I'll be too lazy to do all of this but yeah so yes and this is the mini boxy cosmetic case so the next item that I got in an ornament pattern is this wallet I do already own the same exact wallet, but not in this print in the signature canvas, maybe the block signature canvas, but I wanted to get it in another print and I wanted to get it in the ornament print because I wanted all the items to match because I'm learn I'm starting to realize that I like matching things. So yeah, so I got this wallet and of course I love this wallet, this style of wallet so much. It's so small and compact, but you can hold so much stuff inside of it. And then this is the ID case. You can put two cards right here. It does have a slot right here, which holds quite a few cards as well. And then this inner compartment, you can hold coins, you can hold cash, and you can hold several cards in there. I've had all three in this compartment at once, and it still was not full to capacity. So this little baby is definitely a good wallet to have if you like a smaller compact wallet and it definitely is a staple if you do carry a lot of mini bags because it doesn't take up too much space but I just love it in this print so now I'm coming to you guys with another wristlet this one I'm not gonna go into too much detail in because if you've seen one coach wristlet you've seen them all Ooh, let me take this paper out because you know I'll be taking the paper but and with the same with the other one it does have the camel interior in two car slots so this is the back of it as you can see I really do adore this print and pattern it's so gorgeous and I'm definitely not going to just use it for Christmas time <laughs> just because even though it has the ornaments on it because it's so cute like even though it has the ornaments on it it's not giving Christmas vibes unless you really really look at it so I'm going to use it all year round occasionally when I'm ready to switch some things out but yes I really love this wristlet too and I didn't want to hold up the signature print stuff because it's so much, but I will hold up the ornament print just so you guys can see all of the beautiful items together. So the mini boxy cosmetic case, the wristlet, and the wallet. Or I believe it's called like a card case or something. I'm not sure. Of course, as always, I will put the name on the screen. Okay, guys. So the last um, print pattern that I want to show you guys is um, two things. So, okay, so I just bought this cute, cute, cute Michael Kors bag. Stay tuned for that because I will be doing a what fits and what's in my bag with that bag, but it's super duper cute. But the bag was too cute that I just had to get a matching wallet and a wristlet, but I didn't want to buy one from Michael Kors just because I didn't want, because they're... I didn't want to buy one from Michael Kors only because they're a little expensive, nothing else other than that. And I knew I could get something a little bit cheaper from Coach 
for the price of one item from Michael Kors. So I went to Coach and I got a wristlet and a wallet in the same kind of color, similar to my Michael Kors bag. So this is the Coach double zip wristlet in taupe. And you guys, this is so pretty. I believe this is a pebbled leather. And it's so, so pretty. Um, you know, I'm, I'm really just loving neutrals so much. And this just looks so cute. Look at that. It is gorgeous. So gorgeous. And it does have the little... And it does... <laughs> <laughs> me waiting for the Carter pass but anyways it does have the little bag tag and this if we, we were going to focus and it does have the little bag tag in the same pattern and I'm going to open it up so it has two compartments because it is a double zip of course why not and the zippers go all the way down on the side and in the inside is just this beautiful deep purple color and on this pocket is just the pocket and on this side it has two card slots so yes this is the double zip wristlet so beautiful so beautiful and now I'm gonna show you the wallet so this is I believe the medium ID um, zip around wallet and you guys look at that it's so beautiful and it's so slim I love that like it's not a super long wallet but it's not a compact wallet either but it's certainly very slim look at that that's so thin right but it, this thing holds so much and you can't even tell because of how long and slim it is right and so if I open it up inside you have several um compartments there are one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six twenty seven twenty eight twenty nine twenty ten twenty eleven twenty twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six twenty seven twenty eight twenty nine twenty ten twenty eleven twenty twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six twenty seven twenty eight twenty nine twenty ten twenty eleven twenty twelve thirteen it does have a section for your cash right here and it's all in a deep purple color and it does have coach embossed right here and I can't wait to show y'all this Michael Kohler's bag so stay tuned because it's such a cute bag and yeah and I just wanted to say that I recently just got into like buying purses and wallets and stuff like that like I was such a lazy girl like I just wear my little card case to attach my keys and I walk out the door like I did not care but now I'm so happy that I discovered these things because they genuinely bring me joy even though it's just material things it's just like you shouldn't want to live your life being like I don't want to say like plain but like hmm, what am I trying to say like, I just was lazy. Um, I didn't care about putting effort into, like, um, how I dress or how I did my hair. Or, I would, and honestly, I'm ashamed to admit that I would always just walk out the house looking any kind of way. And that's not good at all. But now, I can um, jazz up my outfits with, like, nice bags. And I'm now I'm getting into shoes, too. So, I'm just happy about that. And it's crazy that it took me to be in almost 30 to get into these things. Like, I just started, well, I didn't just start it, but I just, I, first I, it was makeup, now I'm getting into the shoes and bags. Like, it's crazy how I'm almost 30 and I'm just now getting into being, like, the girly girl that I've always been, but I just was too broke to be as back. So, like, y'all ever see the post, like, you're not ugly, you're just broke? That's definitely me. Um, or, and... Another thing is you're not ugly, you're just broke, and you're not ugly, you're just lazy, because that was me too. Like, when I tell y'all I'll be walking out the house looking any kind of way, like, and it's just like, I'm still young, and I'm beautiful, and it's like I'm wasting away my youth by walking out the house looking crazy. So, that 2022... I'm trying to fix that I tried to fix that this year but sometimes it's just like one of those things like screw it I'm just gonna go because I need to go where I need to go and I don't feel like getting ready but next year 
or I should say this year, I'm not doing that no more. But I'm loving like this whole thing of like just discovering bags and like matching wallets and wristlets and stuff. Like they genuinely make me so like happy, like just to make things match. Cause I'm like a really organized person. I love organized things. I love things that match. Like if you guys can kind of see my house in the background, um, even though it's not where I want it to be, I still try to make it look like a beautiful and comfortable space for me and my daughter. So I love things like that and I'm happy that I'm finally getting into these things. Now, the only thing that I need to work on now is just my health and my um, fitness because I, ha I am slightly overweight and I don't want that to... Um, bring on any health problems in the future. So one of my goals for 2022 is to just focus on my health and losing about like 35 pounds and maintaining that. Um, I do think I'm gonna start vlogging that. So if anybody else is on the same thing next year and wanna join me and we can do this together, I'm going to try. Please, though I'm human so I do make mistakes, but I really wanna try vlogging every week um, for um, the next three months um, to document my weight loss and just getting my life together and not that it's in turmoil or anything but everybody could use some improvement and I'm trying to improve myself so and yeah so because I really need to lose this weight because the majority of my clothes that's in my closet is when I was at a smaller size because I've been yo-yoing between this 200 and like 170 ish for the past five years now and it's got to stop like I really need to find balance in um everything so yeah but I want to start you know being like stylish and stuff and it's like it's kind of frustrating we have this extra weight that makes you feel like crap because it's so taxing on the body and then you have all these nice clothes but you can't really wear them because they don't look the way you want because of this extra weight so that's something that I'm going to be working on on 2022 and yeah so with the, that's the end of this video thank you guys so so much for watching thank you guys for all your comments all your likes your subscriptions everything they do not go unnoticed and i try to make sure i respond to everything and i really really appreciate it i i really really appreciate you guys so so much because it just makes me so happy that strangers that don't know me from a can of paint on the internet is able to be so kind and so polite to me like it's just something that's really really warms my heart because i don't know if you guys know this but i'm a very shy person i stay to myself and so and i know that i'm beautiful but my favorite, favorite compliment, my favorite, favorite compliments that I ever get is always when people will be like, oh, I love your personality. That's my favorite compliments because I'm, it's not often that I share myself with people and the brief um, interactions that I do have with people, I get that so many, so much and it makes me so, so happy. So again, thank you guys so, so much. And I hope you guys really do and genuinely enjoy my content. And I do love to hear feedback. If you think there's things that I need to work on, I'm open to that as well. And without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next one. Happy New Year and goodbye.